Marcia, thank goodness you're here. I just got home, Erica. What is it? I came to tell you about Melanie. What about her? She had a bit of an upset today at the youth center and kinda lost it. When you say a bit of an upset, I mean a massive upset. So this means she erupted and stormed out of the building? Yes. We need your help finding her. She might do something really stupid. Of course. I'd be no sister if I didn't help look for her. Erica, this is really important. Who upset Melanie, and what did they say to make her fly off the handle? It was Mark Johnson. He said he was going to report our family for harboring an illegal alien. And drop you into it. Great, we're dealing with a racist little Torag. I may not have been born on this planet, but it is my home. It's all I know. We need to find my poor little sister before she goes and does something she'll regret later on. I know, and I'm sorry you got dragged into this. You did me a favor by dragging me into it. We should keep looking. And that's what he said. You've had a very hard day today, sweetie. I don't blame you for getting angry about what Mark Johnson said about Marsha. Everybody's really worried about you. They've been looking for you all day. I'm sorry. Don't be silly. Nobody blames you. They'll be really glad you're safe. Marsha took it very hard when Erica told her everything. And she's dealt with it? Yes. She tracked him down and managed to force an apology out of him. I'm ready to go home now, Mrs. Bell. Good. Let's get you home, sweetheart. Your family will be really glad to have you back, safe and sound.